Are you interested in building spinning helicopter rockets? Well, stay tuned to installment number four of the Texas Twister build. Hi, I'm Tim Van Milligan. We're in the middle of the construction of the Texas Twister. This is episode number four. Um, I want to put together the fins at this time. Um, previously, we had put super glue on the surface here. Um, now I want to make sure that this edge here also has super glue on it because we're going to um, use a little trick. And this is in the instructions. The instructions say to use Vaseline, but I found a crayon or wax works just as well. But you need to have the edge nice and smooth. Uh, and the other trick that I want to show you is we need to bevel the edges just slightly. What happens is if we're going to we're going to glue the fins together like this. Um, the when you put the hinge tape on and you hit it with super glue, the super glue shrinks ever so slightly. And what it does is it causes the back end of the flap to kind of tilt up. So what we're going to do is we're going to bevel the bottom edge so that um, we can bend it back. We can stretch it back a little bit. Remember, this is nylon, so nylon will has a little bit of stretch in it. So um, I want to take the fin, and I don't want to go straight on. I want to tilt it just a little bit. I want to break that edge on the bottom, just like that. And then on the uh, flap, we want to do the same thing, but we're going to flip it around, and we're going to do it this way. So now, when we put them together, we'll have a V, and you probably can't see this on the camera, but it's a V um, that when, when, the ha when the tab tilts down, um, that's when they come together. But now we'll go ahead and seal this edge, since I just sanded it. Need a paper towel. Just like that. Um, now, if, if you were to glue them together like this, I guarantee you it's going to be one solid piece because the glue is going to seal everything. So we need to make sure that it, it, it will still move up and down, and that's where the crayon comes in. I'm going to take the crayon and just run some wax on that edge. And you might want to use uh, a color that is going to be similar to the color of your rocket when you're done painting it. Okay, so now we want to put the edges together. And again, I want this edge to be the flush edge. And here on this side, it's a little bit shorter. Then I'm going to lay the hinge tape on there. Just center it up right in the middle. And then goggles again. I want to wick this on there. Oop, it slid. There we go. Okay, and very carefully just blot up the excess glue. Without gluing your finger to it. All right, just like that. And I don't know if you can see this, but it, it did spring it out a little bit. But I can bend it back slightly and stretch, stretch the nylon so it'll be nice and straight. Um, right now, it's, um, you can still hinge it because um, the wax prevented it from um, sticking to itself. And I can rub the wax off. And that's perfect. And that's how we're going to do all three of the fins. So when we come back on the next time, we'll start attaching these, hopefully, to the rocket. So I'm Tim Van Milligan. This is the Apogee Rocketry Workshop. Uh, may the winds be light, may the skies be blue, and may all your rockets fly straight and true.